Overcoming the fear of missing out, FOMO, practical tips and insights. Today, we're diving into a topic that affects so many of us, especially in our hyper-connected world. The fear of missing out, or FOMO. We'll explore what FOMO is, why we experience it, and, most importantly, how to overcome it. If you're new here, don't forget to hit that subscribe button and click the bell icon for more videos on mental health and personal development. Let's get started. So, what exactly is FOMO? FOMO stands for the fear of missing out. It's that nagging feeling that something exciting or interesting is happening elsewhere, and we're not a part of it. This feeling can stem from seeing friends' social media posts, hearing about events or opportunities we didn't attend, or even just thinking about the possibilities out there. FOMO can lead to anxiety, stress, and a sense of dissatisfaction with our own lives. But why do we feel this way? Let's break it down. FOMO is rooted in our basic human nature. Humans are social creatures who thrive on connection and belonging. Historically, being part of a group was essential for survival. Today, this instinct translates into a desire to be in the know and included in social activities. Social media amplifies this instinct. Platforms like Instagram, Facebook, and Twitter show us highlight reels of other people's lives, often making our own lives seem less exciting in comparison. This constant exposure to others' curated experiences can trigger FOMO. So, how can we counter FOMO? Here are some practical tips and strategies to help you manage and overcome this pervasive feeling. Tip 1. Limit social media use. First, limit your social media use. Constantly scrolling through other people's highlight reels can distort our perception of reality. Try setting specific times for social media use and stick to them. You can also use apps that track and limit your screen time. By reducing your exposure, you give yourself a chance to focus on your own life and experiences. Tip 2. Practice mindfulness. Next, practice mindfulness. Mindfulness helps you stay present and appreciate the current moment. Techniques like deep breathing, meditation, and mindful walking can help ground you in the present and reduce anxiety about missing out. There are many great mindfulness apps and guided meditations available online to get you started. Tip 3. Prioritize real-life connections. Another effective strategy is to prioritize real-life connections. Spend time with friends and family in person. Engage in activities that you enjoy and that bring you closer to your loved ones. Real-life interactions are often more fulfilling than virtual ones. Building these genuine connections can help alleviate feelings of loneliness and FOMO. Tip 4. Set personal goals. Setting personal goals can also help. When you have clear objectives and things you're working towards, it's easier to focus on your own journey rather than comparing yourself to others. Break your goals into smaller, manageable steps and celebrate your progress along the way. Graphic. Checklist with goals being checked off. Host. Achieving your own goals can be incredibly fulfilling and reduce the impact of FOMO. Tip 5. Reflect on your values. Reflecting on your values is another key strategy. Take some time to think about what's truly important to you. When you align your actions with your core values, you find more satisfaction and meaning in your own life, reducing the power of FOMO. Write down your values and refer back to them when you feel FOMO creeping in. Tip 6. Digital Detox. Consider doing a digital detox. This doesn't mean you have to go completely offline, but taking a break from social media for a day, a weekend, or even a week can reset your perspective. Use this time to reconnect with yourself and the world around you. Many people find that a digital detox helps them feel more grounded and less anxious about what they're missing online. Tip 7. Seek professional help if needed. Finally, if FOMO is significantly impacting your mental health, don't hesitate to seek professional help. A therapist or counselor can provide you with strategies to manage anxiety and help you build a healthier relationship with social media and your own life. There's no shame in asking for help, and it can make a big difference in your well-being. To wrap things up, FOMO is a common feeling in our digitally connected world, but it's not insurmountable. By implementing these strategies, you can shift your focus from what you're missing out on to what you have and what you can create in your own life. Remember, it's about finding balance and living a life that's true to you. Thank you so much for watching. If you found this video helpful, please give it a thumbs up, share it with someone who might need it, and subscribe for more content on mental health and personal growth.
See you in the next video. Take care and stay mindful.